All right. Hello, wine drinking people. Today is Saturday, June 4th. And um, what happened to Australian Wine Week? I don't know, but uh, one of the smallest turnouts of any tasting that we've had, the uh, Australian Tasting at Cafe Max. And we've rescheduled the Vintage Australian Tasting. It was supposed to happen last night to the ninth, the 17th of June, just two weeks. Uh, so those of you that wanted to come to that, uh, it's the 17th of June. The same wines were taken down. It's up on the calendar again. And people that know me are looking at the calendar going, what the heck's going on? There's not an event on the calendar for next week. Are we not doing any drinking over at the Wine Watch? No, say it isn't so. It's not so. And unfortunately, uh, yeah, we just couldn't come together with the Kermit Lynch event. It was supposed to happen on Wednesday. We'll have to reschedule that, Anthony. Sorry again. And then uh, Saturday, next Saturday week from tonight, we have got one of the most comprehensive tastings of Italian wines we've ever done here at the Wine Watch. Yes, that's right, folks. We will have 26 different producers. Are you kidding me? The lineup of producers in Winebow's portfolio, Leonardo Lacasio Selections, is absolutely stunning. From all corners of the Italian peninsula, we've got producers coming. We're going to have tables set up outside in the grotto. We will have Tony from Wine Watch Catering here preparing a variety of different foods to go with the I don't know, 100 different wines that we'll be serving, all for just $35. It Could it be true? Yes, folks, that's right. That's why we had to wait until one week before the event to put out the notice because we would absolutely be overrun with people signing up for this event. But we've only got about 75 spaces available because we've got 25 producers here, man. They're going to be taking up a lot of room themselves. So we're going to cap the event at uh, 75 tasters here inside and outside. So, um, you know, hopefully we're crossing our fingers the weather is good, man, because we might get a little wet. That's the only thing that could happen, whether it be us sweating or whether it be us getting rained on. But the show must go on next Saturday night, June 11th. We will have Allegrini, Altesino, Orgiano, Bera, Biselica, Botromaggio, Castello di Bassi, Corte Giara, De Maggio Norante, Falesco, Franz Hatz, Chris, Leonardo Castris, Maculan, Master Berendino, Poggio alla Tesoro, Poli, Pernotto, San Polo, Sansonia, Stella, Tasca della Mirita, Tiffenbrunner, Tramon, Tua Rita, Valle Reale, Vitiano, Zardetto, and Zenato. That's right, folks. All those guys are going to be here at the store next week. Check it out on today's email. I'm your host, Andrew Lampassoni, signing off for the Wine Watch, saying, remember, always drink the good stuff first.